add these three magic words in front of your affirmations to make them more believable. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kenneth Wong, Manifestation Coach here, and my channel is all about self-help, spirituality, and manifestation. If you're a fan of any of these topics, then make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you get notified every time I post a new video. Today, I want to talk to you guys about affirmations. Now, if you've been using affirmations for a while and you don't feel like they're working for you, then this video is for you. Now, from working with my clients, I know that the biggest reason why affirmations don't work is because they feel too far-fetched. They don't feel believable. So when you say them, they just feel false to you. Do you know what I'm talking about? Like, for example, let's say someone just lost their job. Right? An affirmation like, I am working at my dream job will just feel totally false and totally not believable. Or let's say that someone just broke up with their partner. An affirmation like, I am in a loving relationship with my partner will feel false, will feel totally untrue. The entire point of using affirmations is to repeat these affirmations until they become a belief in your subconscious mind. But when the affirmation feels so out of reach from where you currently are, it can actually enhance that gap and prevent that affirmation from integrating itself into your subconscious beliefs. And when the affirmation is too unbelievable, it also makes it difficult to feel into the words and channel the emotion of the affirmation as if it has already manifested. In fact, it will just feel false to you. So that's why I wanted to make this video so that I can teach you how you can make this small modification to your affirmations to make them more believable. All you have to do is to add these three words in front of your affirmation. I am willing to. Let's go back to the example where someone just broke up with their partner, right? An affirmation like, I believe he's coming back or I believe she's coming back may feel too out of reach at this point. So what you want to do is to add, I am willing to in front of your affirmation. So instead you say, I'm willing to believe he's coming back or I'm willing to believe she's coming back. When you add, I'm willing to in front of your affirmations, it automatically makes that affirmation true because yes, in this moment, I am willing to believe that I might not fully believe in it, but I'm willing to. And that willingness is all it takes to shift your affirmation from feeling false to true. And this tweak is very versatile and you can apply it to all kinds of affirmations. For example, if someone is broke and they're trying to manifest abundance, instead of saying an affirmation like, I'm a millionaire, right? That will feel totally false. He can say, I'm willing to believe in abundance or I'm willing to believe that there are creative ways to earn money or I'm willing to believe there is a better way than this. I'm willing to believe in possibilities. I'm willing to believe in miracles. There are so many ways to apply this, you guys. So just take this three words and apply it to your affirmations. So the next time you're using your affirmations and you feel that they're not totally true to you, then just add these three words, I am willing to, in front of it and see what happens. Now I want to see you put this into action. Comment down below your favorite affirmation and add I am willing to in front of it and let me know how it feels to you. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give this video a like and share it with your friends because this technique is so valuable when it comes to using affirmations. So I want everyone to have it. As always, thank you so much for watching my video. I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.